and then they put the clip here so it just seemed to me like might have been intentional you know to discourage folks from working on their own stuff so that they you know gotta pay a mechanic um so i don't know that's that's my conspiracy theory anyway uh but you know another thing is like they could have just try to go straight back with this and have some kind of a dual exhaust i mean i i, I see they're probably trying to avoid the fuel system but you know that's what heat shields are for too so i don't know i don't know for sure <sighs> I can find that one did i already do that one I'm not. and then you got to keep track of which ones you did already <laughs> it's funny you can see my face is right up against that exhaust pipe too there's not a lot of room unless you've got it up on jack stands or on a lift you know heck i've got a neighbor i've seen he had a truck up on blocks of wood and he well of course that's still been there for months but uh, whoop almost got gotcha. you but uh i guess that's one reason to stay thin you can see i'm pressed right up in here if i gain any any weight boy i, I won't be able to do this sort of thing anymore i'd have to go buy oh man a lift would be so cool too but my garage isn't exactly large enough for such a thing this truck might be able to stick the front end in there not much more than that anyway i'm about about done torquing these down to uh to their german specs so now I'm just going to kind of walk it around since I alternated already. I'm just going to walk around and just tighten them down just a little more till they feel nice and even. You know, that's the main thing. You don't want uh, some bolts tightened down more than others because then you'll have a, a spot in the gasket that won't make a good seal. And you'll have a leak there. So I'm going to go around one more time and just make sure that they're all about the same amount of uh, torque. But that's it. You can uh, stop the video now. We'll pick up when we fill. The, the square button? Yep.